how to back up your Mac if you are using MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, iMac or Mac Mini, the steps are going to be same. Now let's say you are selling out your Mac to someone else or you are giving your Mac to use it to someone else. Before that, it is always necessary to erase your Mac completely and before erasing, you should always back up your Mac. How can you back up? So the process is actually very simple. We are going to use time machine to do the backup. First of all, you need external drive to uh, take the backup. So let me connect external drive first. Now I have connected external drive. As you can see, it has appeared on desktop. Now, once you connect external drive to your Mac, after that, you can go in system settings. You can find that option in dock or else you can go and select Apple logo and then system settings. Now, once you open system settings, uh, you know, search for time machine over here. It will appear like this or else you can directly go and select general option and then time machine. If you are using Mac with older OS version, you can search for time machine directly or it, you will get time machine option directly over here. But in Mac OS Sonoma, you can go in general and search for time machine. So select time machine over here. And after that, you will get this page. You need to select add backup disk. So select this option. And as I told you, we need to connect external uh, drive. So as we have connected external drive, it has showcased here. So just select setup drive. After that, you will get a pop-up screen. If you want to encrypt your backup, you can turn on this toggle and then you can add password over here. But if you don't want to encrypt your backup, you can turn off this toggle. So I'm going to turn it off for now and just simply select done option. You can see it is preparing the external drive. So we need to wait for it. So now the disk has appeared over here and it is showing waiting to backup. So we need to wait for the backup to start. So now you can see it will start the backup to this particular disk. So definitely it will take some time to complete the backup. And once the backup is complete, you'll get to know. Now, once the backup is complete, you will get notified like this. So you can check out your last backup time over here. And if I minimize this window and if I go in this drive now, you can find your backup over here. So if you're setting up new Mac, you can connect this drive uh, to your new Mac during the setup and you can clone your old data. You can basically uh, install your backup to your new Mac over there. So this is how simple it is to backup your Mac using Time Machine. So if you find this video informative, don't forget to subscribe. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.